Good morning, you guys. This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying, this is daily tea. It's a little different than my other readings. It's more general current pulling of the energy. It's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time that you view it. However, everyone's on different time of life paths. So for some of you guys, it can resonate outside the 72-hour time frame. Just saying. Um, I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. There's no live today. Um, just saying, just saying. So you got me pre-recorded. Okay, so um, I did get a channel in this morning, so I'm going to share it. Um, the channel I received was a particular high-level Scorpio. Um, position of high authority is about to get wind of a particular single mother, fire sign single mother's um, uh, tarot card reading channel soon. Um, they are about to be pissed at others and their lack of, um, support when, um, when they view this tarot card reading channel is what I heard. Um, they are about to learn a lot is what I just heard. They are about to learn a lot. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So whoever you are, Scorpio, um, high level Scorpio position of high authority, um, sir or ma'am, whoever you are. Your high level, your position of high authority, it's all about you apparently in here today. But um, I heard you're about to re, uh, learn of a particular single mother fire signs tarot card reading channel. And I heard um, you're going to be pissed when you, I guess, view this channel, look at the channel, look at the stats, look at something on there, I'm assuming. I heard you're going to be pissed at the lack of support. And um, I guess that uh, people have not been supporting this fire sign single mother in some shape, form, or fashion, or they, maybe they drug her name into the ground, or, you know, maybe she was supposed to get some kind of opportunity, or offered an opportunity, or I don't know, some kind of lack of support in some shape, form, or fashion, but I heard basically it's gonna, uh, it's going to light a serious fire under the Scorpio's ass, serious, about to create many, 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 many negative series of chain events for others. In this community. Yeah. Okay. And for one particular air sign. Okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. This Scorpio. I'm feeling this Scorpio's energy. Holy crap and moly. Okay. Coming in strong, Scorpio. Uh, high level Scorpio. Position of high authority. Um, I heard it's got a lot of fire on your ass. So it sounds like you like this fire sign single mother. It sounds like you like her. Um, it's Aries Leo Sag, single mother. She could have Aries Leo or Sag in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hamner, Jupiter cards. But I think somebody's about to tell you about this um, tarot card reading channel. She's a tarot card reader, just like me, just saying. So I think somebody's about to tell you about the tarot card reading channel. Um, and it sounds like you like her in some shape, form, or fashion. Or maybe she's done something very positive for the world or the community. Um, and maybe she didn't get credit or accolades or the proper financial compensation or what have you, however that resonates, um, and it pisses you off. Um, I heard you're going to start creating very negative series of chain events for many people in, it sounds like, her community or your community or both, um, and one particular air sign. So whoever this air sign is, I don't know who the air sign is, you have to plug the air sign in, how it resonates, whoever this air sign is that's connected to this fire sign. Um, air signs are Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts if this resonates. Serious lack of information was given to this fire sign single mother. This Scorpio is about to get a huge wake up call. Okay, I heard serious lack of information was given to this fire sign single mother. And, um, uh, the Scorpio is about to get a huge wake-up call. So it's all about you, high-level position, high-authority Scorpio. I mean, whoever you are, sir, ma'am, my goodness. I'm not sure. Um, I'm thinking maybe a politician, maybe you're a um, scholar, maybe you are, um, maybe you're a professor at a high-level university, a university like Yale or Harvard or, I don't know. Um, maybe you are a, um, I'm not sure. You're very high level, though. You, I think you might have a security clearance because I heard high level. I think you might have a security clearance. 
you might work for CIA, you might work for the Fed, you might work for, um, I don't know. I, you have to plug in how it resonates, but you're high level. I think you have a security clearance for sure, for sure. Um, but however that resonates, um, I heard there was serious lack of information there. So she, um, she was not given information, it sounds like, by her community um, or from her community or from this air sign like she was supposed to. Um, however this resonates um, in one's life. Most certainly was not. The shit's about to hit the fan. Oh, okay. I heard most certainly was not, and the shit's about to hit the fan. And I heard shit, so um, so she wasn't. So this Scorpio, you, sir, ma'am, high-level person, possible security clearance. I feel you might be a politician. You might be the president, possibly, because our president is the Scorpio. Um, you might be, a po oh, I said politician. You might be... Um, um, some kind of huge game changer energy in the world. Um, maybe you want a, um, uh, what is it called? Um, I could think of it any other day, but um, I think of it, I'll let you know. Um, the really game changing, wonderful awards um, that people get for changing the world in a very positive way. I can't think of the name of the award right now. Um, but I think you're very in intellectual. I think you're intellectual. I think you, um, I think you truly care about people and you have a high position of authority. We're not talking about abuse of power here, whoever you are. This is not abuse of power. This is managing your power in a very positive way. High level Scorpio and my hat's off to you because there's been so much abuse of power, especially with that secret seven crap. Um, that is nice to see somebody that doesn't, that actually utilizes their high level authority and power in a very positive way, sir or ma'am, whoever you are. We have boundaries, upright, number 12 could be very significant in one's life, number 12, it could be a possible age of, um, your child or somebody you're connected to's child, it could be a lottery number, a uh, social security card number, green card number, date of birth number, etc., 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 number 12, boundaries. This Scorpio is about to play some serious whoop ass on several people, not physical. By using their throat chakra. Serious abuse of power in the past. Serious. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, this is serious. Um, you're pissed off about this high-level Scorpio. Um, and I don't blame you because I would be too. I would be too. Um, nobody should abuse their power in any shape, form, or fashion, especially a single uh, uh, abuse of power over a single mother. Um, that's insane in the membrane. Insane in the brain. I mean, it is. It is. Uh, why would you want to exert any kind of unnecessary abuse of power over anybody, especially a single mother that's trying to take care of their children? In a proper, healthy, copacetic manner. At least I would hope she is. But it sounds like she is because it sounds like you like her. So it sounds like she does do what she's supposed to do. It doesn't sound like she's out prostituting herself, getting knocked up by five or six baby daddies, um, got the whole community on lock. Five o'clock, I'll be at Mario's house and get $1,500 for a BJ. 5.30, I'm at um, Sergio's house. I get um, $500 for a reverse cowgirl. 6.30, I'm at um, Jack's house. I get um, $1,500, you know, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It's not like that. This person really works hard for their money in a very legal way, I'm presuming. And, um, you know, they don't manipulate people. They don't manipulate people. Um, and I think you know this. So boundaries upright. I heard you're about to put some serious whoop ass on several members of this community, particularly an air sign, a Gemini Libra Aquarius air sign. Mask on or fem, Gemini Libra Aquarius. They could have Gemini Libra Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or fem, and Jupiter charts. This air sign has completely abused their power for many years. This Scorpio is about to make it very well known and create negative series of chain events for them. Oh my God. Wow. Holy crap. I heard this air sign has abused their power for many years. For many years. 
it sounds like this Arizon is a position of authority. Um, and I'm serious about that. I didn't hear they were, but I'm not, that's my presumptive logic of reasoning and guessment that they are. Because you can be a position of authority and abuse your power or not abuse your power. And that's just the truth. Um, but it sounds like they have. It sounds like they're a position of authority and they've abused their power for many years. But you, Scorpio, you know this. Um, and you're about to let it be well known. Um, you're about to create negative series of chain of events for them. So I think you're over them in some shape, form, or fashion, or you're going to communicate to someone that is over them or give some kind of information of their abuse of power to where they won't be over people to abuse their power. At least, God, I hope so. So we have boundaries upright. You're about to set boundaries on this air sign, this Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, masculine, or femme, possible position of authority, person that's going to um, hopefully remove them from their position uh where whatever position they have so they cannot abuse people um is what i'm presuming here blossoming darkness number 33 or 40 could be very significant numbers in one's life number 33 or 40 it could be possible age of you or somebody you're connected to possible date of birth number possible lottery number Possible jersey number, possible social security card number, 33 and 40, blossoming and darkness. This Scorpio knows this air, uh, sorry, not this air sign. This fire sign has a lot, a lot, a lot of fight in them, and they are right. They have blossomed through the most darkest times. This Scorpio is about to reward this fire sign, single mother. Went through extremely traumatic times. And this Scorpio knows it. Okay, wow, this is beautiful, Scorpio. So if this resonates for you, I heard basically, um, you, you know this fire sign single mother, or you've heard about her, how this resonates. You've either heard about her or you know her, how that resonates. But I heard, uh, you know, she's went through a lot of hard times. That basically she can go through, get through anything. Um, maybe you've seen her get through anything or you've heard about her getting through anything, but she's very resilient like a rubber band. She's very resilient. She comes back. She bounces back. She gets in there. She does what she needs to do. She's a go-getter. She um, takes, so I'm assuming she obviously takes care of her kids in a proper manner. She gets in there. She does what the hell she needs to do for herself and her kids. And you know this. You know this. So I don't know if this person has passed from you or you've heard about her from somebody. But you're a high position, high authority. I think you probably heard about her from somebody. Or you've seen her go through something. Maybe she's a person in your past. I don't know. But how that resonates, I heard basically um, you, you, you know she's went through a lot. You know she's went through a lot. I heard a very traumatic experience. A very traumatic experience. Um, and basically, you're going to reward her in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and it sounds like negatively affect this um, air sign in some shape, form, or fashion. So she can blossom through anything, even when people crap on her or pee on her or just leave her out in the cold. And she's been left out many, 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 many times. You're about to realize this. Okay, I heard she's been left out many, many, many times, and uh, you're about to realize this. So you're about to realize she's been left out a ton. Um, the people basically didn't give her opportunities that they should have, or she was looked over, or it was she was treated unfairly. Maybe it was her next time for something, and then she got looked over, or um, somebody stole from her, or somebody... Um, was trying to take away uh, her rights or or something of that nature unfairly. She sounds like a very high vibrational being. She doesn't sound like a low vibrational being, like I gave you the example of the community prostitute. Um, that's low vibrational. This person sounds very high, high vibrational. Um, and I heard she can get through anything, and you know this. So blossoming upright, darkness upright. It really pisses off other people. In her community. And it's about to really piss them off. Because wonderful things are about to come her way. 
Okay. Heard it really pisses off um, people in her community. Uh, it's about to really piss them off because wonderful things are coming her way. So she's got a lot of hateration in her community. Now, I don't think everybody in her community hates her, but I do think, because, um, you know, people move out, people move in, people move away. So I don't think everybody in her community hates her. Uh, but the ones that have seen her go through the tough, tough times, I'm sure they hate her because they wanted her to fail. They probably wanted her to lose her home, lose her vehicle, lose her kids, lose her life, um, lose her livelihood. Just uh, they wanted her to be depressed. I heard they wanted her to go give up, cry, run into a dark hole and cry. Well, no, you can't go and run to a dark hole and cry because you get through because uh, you go through hard times. For anybody doesn't uh, that needs to hear that. That's not how you handle things. In order to successfully, successful, successfully handle things, you've got to get up, get off your butt, and get out there and grab life by the horns. If you get treated unfairly, you get treated unfairly. If you don't, you don't, and that's great. But at least you know you tried, and that's the truth. So darkness upright. I heard that some of them want her to be depressed. But she doesn't sound like a type that's depressive. She sounds like the opposite. She most certainly is. Okay, I heard she most certainly is. And I heard um, she's about to be rewarded in a huge way. So I think you're about to reward her or you're about to create a series of chain events to help reward her. However, this resonates in your life. Um, Scorpio, position of high authority, Scorpio, whoever you are. Um, this is really wonderful um, energy. It truly is. Um, just saying, just saying. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. Several shocking series of time events are going to occur in this. Someone in this community is about to get a visitor. Very high level shocking visitor. Oh, my God. A lot of high level people in here. Okay, I heard several shocking series of time events are about to occur in this community. So, this community was all about, I think, blockages for her in the past they just did not want her to succeed they just didn't um but it sounds like the energy is shifting because probably because people knew people have moved in um people have moved on and it's created a new community meaning different people in the community so yeah there's still those low vibing people still in the community but there's new inner fresh energy in there too and god forbid they don't want people to know what they did in the past so they can't probably talk about it just saying just saying but i heard there's about to be a high level visitor in this community soon um it's about to shock a lot of people and several shocking series of shame events are about to occur and it sounds like an air sign is about to get it this air sign is about to be pissed low vibrational air sign okay i heard this low vibrational air sign is about to be pissed so if you're an air sign and that doesn't resonate with you, you're not the low vibrational air sign, then, you know, that's not your story. You know, you could be on the outskirts of this looking in high vibrational air sign. Just saying, just saying. When I pull in low vibrational energies, if it's not for you, it's not for you. You just have to plug yourself in the stories where you fit. If you do, I just want a disclaimer that, okay? But I heard this, we're pulling in this low vibrational air sign that apparently has been severe karmic energy to this fire sign single mother. They just, they don't want her to do well. They truly, truly do not. Obviously, it sounds like it's been proven in the past. Um, but I heard basically the Scorpio knows this or they're about to find this out. They're about to visit the community. It's about to piss this um, air sign off, this low vibrational air sign that sounds like it's been blocking this fire sign single mother. Um, and several shocking series of chain events are about to occur. So that could be the blossoming for the single mother, fire sign single mother. I um, mean, I think the energy is about to reverse and put the fire, um, sorry, the air sign, low vibrational air sign in depression. Um, because they want so ill for this fire sign single mother, but she's like a phoenix rising from the ashes. She just keeps coming back. Um, and um, he or she, low vibrational air sign, just doesn't want that. They don't want that. So um, it's going to piss them off. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. One of these low vibrational air signs is about to get very, very, very ill very soon. Long history of medical conditions. 
Okay. Uh, so there's at least two vibration, low vibrational air signs over here. <coughs> Excuse me. I heard they have a long history of medical conditions. So I heard medical. I don't know about the mental health side. They could have a history of mental health as well, but I didn't hear that. I heard medical. So hypertension, hyperlipidemia. These are just examples. I'm not, I didn't hear this. These are just examples. Hyper, hypertension, hyperlipidemia, um, uh, type 1 or type 2 diabetes, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, the list could go on. Um, however this resonates. Those are just some examples. It could be. I heard a long list of medical conditions. So they have got something going on medically. And I heard, I heard basically they're going to start getting very ill soon. So I think one of their medical conditions is going to exacerbate um, is what I think. That's exactly what I think. But you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. And namaste.